But it ain't about how hard you hit. It's about how hard you can get hit and keep moving forward. How much you can take and keep moving forward. That's how winning is done. Now, if you know what you're worth, then go out and get what you're worth. But you gotta be willing to take the hits and not pointing fingers saying you ain't where you want to be because of him or her or anybody. It is currently 8 21 right now and your girl is about to get ready for class tomorrow i have class at 9 a.m so i gotta be up real early i'm about to help my future self out by picking out what i'm gonna wear to the gym tomorrow taking out my clothes for school because we do have to wear scrubs <laughs> why did my voice just crack like that we do have to wear scrubs so I'm going to take out my clothes, my sneakers that I'm going to wear, pack my book bag for tomorrow. And then before I go to sleep, I am going to review some of the material. Um, This is my schedule right here. Like, not your girl in school. Okay. <laughs> um, I'm hyped for this shit. Like, I don't know about y'all. I've been in this school for at least a week. And I really like it. Everybody's really nice. It's real comforting. I go to school in the city. I'm not going to say where because safety reasons. But I have classes Monday. Um, I have no classes Tuesday. I have classes Wednesday, Thursday, Friday. So I have Tuesday off and then the weekends off, obviously. But Monday I have class from 9 a.m. to 1 p.m. So that's my class tomorrow and then i have like two online classes i have online class every friday and every wednesday i have an online class and then i have an in-person class after my online class you know all that good stuff so um i just finished editing some of the video that i'm filming because 
now that I'm in school I gotta be on top of these things which I'm like not mad at at all because I personally love feeling productive and oh by the way don't panic um my hair I had a I had a wig on on top of my hairstyle that I had because I had to do a wig promo really quickly but like I was saying I like to feel productive I personally hate feeling like I'm not doing anything with my life hence the reason I am in school and I'm just trying to get as much like done while I'm young if that makes sense like I'm gonna go to school still focus on my YouTube channel like and you know God forbid anything happens with the internet which I doubt it will but like I just still want something like stable IRL like that's not on the internet because me personally y'all know I be in my mood sometimes where I don't want to film and if I don't film I don't make money so that's why your girl's going to school in case one day I don't want to do this YouTube shit no more <laughs> which I doubt I don't know but like come on I don't really want to be like 40 years old doing YouTube I don't know I could be saying that now enough chatting let me start picking out what I'm gonna wear to the gym tomorrow as for my scrubs it's just a simple uniform so that I don't gotta put no type of thought into that um period i had this hairstyle and for a week already longer than a week maybe like two weeks i had this ponytail style um jen's hair lab y'all tap in with her i've been so tired of wearing wigs so i want to switch it up i still do my wig promos but i take it off right after as y'all can see i had on a wig earlier i had to do a promo to that shit right off after Zan glue her down but <clears throat> let's start getting ready for tomorrow so that way I'm not running around like a chicken with my head cut off when it comes to me waking up early um, I don't know what I'm wearing to the gym tomorrow but y'all know I always gotta have me a cute little gym fit the better the fit the better the workout that's just that's just the way it is these are my scrubs I'm not gonna show y'all the front because it has the name of the school. Your girl is in scrubs. Like, when I wear my scrubs, I be feeling important. Or oh, whatever. But I'm gonna wear this, obviously. Like, we have to wear a uniform, clearly. Um, I don't know what I wanna wear. Alright, tomorrow's gym fit is gonna be my Chuck Taylors. I'm wearing all black gym fit. I feel like I really don't be wearing all black to the gym. I personally don't like to because I like to wear colorful colors because dressing in all black is mad depressing. Like, no, no shade, no tea on the people who like to wear all black all the time. But I personally like to wear like colors but i'm really not putting too much thought into my gym outfit tomorrow I, i'm gonna do some studying before i go to bed um that was super easy like just picked out my fit um so oh i do have to eat before i go to sleep i didn't eat my third meal yet um i'm gonna have some alfredo chicken alfredo before i go to sleep learning medical terminology is literally learning a new language it's not easy but i can do it period i personally have been going ahead like because i really want to be on top of my game when it comes to schoolwork and all that type of stuff so i've been studying ahead and learning like vocab vocabulary um so right now class has just started so we're really just learning like terminology when it comes to stuff in the medical field i wonder if i should make index cards today like Okay, I don't know what I want to do. I'm not gonna lie. Baby, I'm feeling indecisive. I don't know if I want to read from my textbook or do I want to make some index cards. I think I'm just going to read for 30 minutes just because I do want to get up early since I have class at 9 a.m. It's 8.32 so I can read literally for the next 30 minutes and then go to sleep. So that's what I'll do. We'll make index cards another day just because class is literally just started so we're just like getting introduced to the material. Let me put my phone in my living room so I don't get distracted by this shit. Now 
then eat your rice and your cabbage too. I'm back from class. It's about to like, I don't really know. I got out of class at like 12 something. So it's probably like one something, maybe going on 2 p.m. It's fairly early in the day. I had class super early. Um, the class that I was in today was anatomy. Um, anatomy, visit, anatomy, physiology, phys something like that, girl. I don't know. My brain is fried from learning. Like, ugh. So that class, I had just got put in it, and I missed the last Monday. So I was a little behind on track. I was a little backtracked in that class because I missed the first class because it wasn't on my schedule yet. I didn't have my schedule and all that type of stuff. So yeah, I got to play catch up in that class because we have our finals in like July midterm. It's literally in three weeks. So your girl is locked in and studying and just you know gym school i'm locked in like we're getting this money in this education we're not playing no games it's real nice outside i think it's like 60 something degrees i gotta go pick up a package because i ordered something from shein and i fell asleep when it was time for them to deliver the package so i missed my freaking package so now i gotta go to the post office to pick it up and then after that i'm gonna go to the gym you know when you get a new package and you're just like itching to open it? Like I could open this shit right here, right now, in the middle of the street. I just be fiending to open my packages. Let me tell you something you already know. The world ain't all sunshine and rainbows. It's a very mean and nasty place and I don't care how tough you are, it will beat you to your knees and keep you there permanently if you let it. it ain't about how hard you hit. It's about how hard you can get hit and keep moving forward. How much you can take and keep moving forward.
your girl just got from the gym my hair is sweaty i gotta slick it back eyelashes is looking crazy i'm looking crazy um it's currently 8 50 hey your girl was in the gym since 6 p.m okay i deadlifted and then i hit legs and i hit legs yesterday I'm a soldier. I know I'm not gonna be able to walk tomorrow, but I love that freaking feeling. My eyelashes bother me. I'm gonna redo these shits tomorrow. Um, so please excuse them. But if you're angry, bro, hit legs. Like I don't know why y'all not in the gym yet. Like I'm really confused. Like if you're not going to the gym, lock in, twin. Lock in. Seriously. Like why the fuck are you not going to the gym? Like I feel like everybody should go to the gym. I don't give a fuck. What's your excuses? You need to be in the gym, okay? Summer is a couple days away. Don't even do it for summer. It's just such a great stress reliever. Like, after the gym, I be overstimulated, but like in a good way. Like, I be having mad energy. I feel good. My endorphins are on 10. Like, bitch, this is a natural high. Like, I don't gotta do drugs. I don't gotta drink. I don't gotta smoke. I don't, I don't gotta do none of that shit no more. Like, bitch, I go to the gym and I get high off life. Oh, fuck. No, but seriously, after the gym, I just be on 10. Like, I'm on 10 right now. I really am hungry. It's 9 p.m. I got to figure out what I want to eat because the taco truck, not the taco truck, the taco place next to my house is closed. Like, sometimes they be closed, sometimes they be open. Like, they're unfreaking reliable. Ugh, and I'm so mad because I walked all the way home thinking, like, I literally took a specific route thinking that, okay, I'm going to order from the truck. Not, I keep saying the truck, bitch. We not in Atlanta. Lock in. Um, Order from the store. I literally walked away where the store is. Just like find out that this the shit is closed. So I don't know if studying has happened tonight. I'm not going to burn myself out. I'm going to edit tonight. So, I mean, I put, that's how you know I put in work. Because, bro, look at my hair. My edges have retracted. Like, what the fuck is happening right now? Anyways, let me figure out what the fuck I'm about to eat. Living in New York, be like... Let me figure out what I'm about to eat so I can eat something good, edit, and go to fuck to sleep. Good morning, guys. It's currently 11.02 a.m. I've been up since 9 a.m. I have a doctor's appointment. I just finished getting ready for it. I took my lashes off. I had on some cluster lashes, and they were bothering me because I be putting them way too close to my waterline, and I need to stop doing that shit, and I be going to sleep, and it be poking me in my fucking eye, and I feel like that shit gonna make me go blind. So, I took them shits out, okay? And I'm gonna redo them. I got an eye doctor's appointment today because your girl does wear glasses, but I don't really know, like, what for specifically. I know when I was, like, younger, I got, um, sp Bitch, don't embarrass me. <laughs> I got prescribed. I was about to fuck that word up so bad. I got prescribed glasses. I had re reading glasses, I think it was. Something like that. I might have been reading glasses. Since I'm in school, I made an eye doctor's appointment. Just so, like, I am, I am focusing to my best ability. And I feel like if you're somebody who wears glasses and you're not wearing glasses and you're trying to learn something, I feel like that fake can make it, like, a little harder. Because especially if you can't see or really read the material right you know so i'm like let me see what my eyes is talking about and bitch i need glasses i know i need glasses like for a fact like there there's no way i'm gonna leave this doctor doctor's appointment and they're gonna tell me oh yeah you have 2020 i spilled water on myself not too much Nah, I can't see nothing. They put some fucking drops in my eyes. I can't look at my phone. I don't see nothing on my phone. Everything is fucking blurry, bro. I can't see shit. I mean, bro, I cannot see. Like, I literally just see a blurry figure. Bro, I cannot see. Shout out to my Nana because she literally just came to my house to drop off all my packages, y'all. This is just one bag of all the packages she just brought over here. Let's do a PR haul, okay? So I already know when I get packages like this and this, these are wig companies. So those are my sponsorships. Another way that I make money 
is I am a wig influencer. Oh, I'm sorry. I've been wig influencing for years. Like, if you're an OG, look, look at her trying to be nosy. Like, every time something new come in the house, this girl turned into TSA. She checking bags. She seeing if it's safe. All that. Feel me? I love my cat so much. But anyways, bro, don't drop the camera, please. Let's start with the big boxes just because I'm intrigued. Ooh, girl. Your girl is never going to run out of facial tissue. This is um, a sponsorship for the TikTok shop. Look at my cat in the box. <laughs> That's why I love getting boxes because she loves jumping in. Second package is this vanity LED mirror. Um, also from the TikTok shop. I redid my lashes, y'all. As you can see. And I did go to my eye doctor's appointment and the girl does need glasses, like I said. We have a hair company. This is a clay turmeric mask. Turmeric is really good for the skin. This is a gym outfit. I know what this is. This is a gym outfit. Y'all, the body is finna eat in this, okay? I'm wearing this to the gym tomorrow. Are you done? I gotta promote this on the TikTok shop. Don't sleep on the TikTok shop now. Like, make sure y'all follow me on TikTok as well, period. We have a wig from Wig Fever. And y'all, I have a whole bunch of wigs in my closet. When I tell y'all, I probably own like over 200 wigs, maybe more. If y'all ever want a wig, like I got anything you could freaking imagine. DM me, send me an email and we could get you a wig for an affordable price. That's brand new. I only wear all my wigs once. I, I only got one head. Like, I'm not wearing all these wigs. I always have to change my wigs because I do promos. So if y'all ever need you a used wig, well, it's barely used. It's only been worn once, girl. DM me or send me an email. And we could work some shit out. And then we have a wig from Ali Pearl Hair. This box is cute or whatever. Okay, Ali Pearl Hair, come through. Come through. I'm finna put this bitch on tonight. Look at this. I love when the wigs come like this, y'all. Like, you ain't gotta do nothing to this shit. Like, this my. Sh this my. They they talk God that is definitely one of my favorite gospel songs. It's called God Favored Me. I just want to come on here and update y'all. It is 11.23 p.m. Today did not really go as planned, but that's okay. I ended up having to go to like two doctor's appointments. And I wanted to go to the park and spend time in nature and study and make index cards. But I did not get to do that today. I am gonna read excuse me i am gonna be reading out of my textbook before i go to bed because the class that i have tomorrow focuses around like what they talk about in this textbook and i'm gonna go over some of my notes um just do some studying before i go to sleep there's like so much more i wanted to do but i don't want to burn myself out and i want to make sure that i get up early tomorrow i do have class at 12 p.m i'm still gonna get up super early just so that way i'm not getting up and i'm like rushing to go to class so that way like my brain is already awake um by the time it's time for me to get out my house and stuff like that i'm probably gonna wake up like 7 30 and you know so i can have like a slow morning routine and i don't have to just like grab everything and go um i changed my hairstyle i did not want to let that ponytail go the girl who did my hair did such a good job because i did not even need to take that ponytail out my hair was still laid jen's hair lab y'all tap in with her on instagram okay she bodied my hair if you follow me on instagram you've probably already seen it when yeah whatever um yeah tomorrow i have two classes i have a class from 12 to 1 and then a class from 1 to 4 and then i'll be hitting the gym after study go to sleep yeah we'll see what tomorrow brings god's will but y'all it's the fact that these presents are still like hold on y'all see that it's not lifting but yeah i'm just gonna study for a bit so yeah i'll talk to you guys tomorrow morning bye
guys y'all can see i'm getting ready for class um i don't have class till 12 but it's like currently like 8 30 something um better late well hold on not better late than ever better early than ever i don't know they don't have a saying for that one but i literally just put on blush every day without like having to put on actual makeup and this just makes me look more awake and i freaking love wearing blush like it just makes my face look so much more awake and vibrant and rosy and then i love to overline my lips this is the three products i use every single day i put on some blush and i put on some lip liner so i don't have to wear makeup i gotta fill up my water bottle today seems like it's pretty gloomy outside like there's no type of sun out right now whatsoever so i'm pretty sure it's probably like cold outside that's why i have on this uh gray long sleeve because i'm gonna wear my uniform on top of this and i don't really want to be cold in the classroom but shout out to my classmate i was in class and we was talking about i don't know what we were talking about but i was saying how i had to go get a new water bottle and she put me on she was like girl go to marshall's to get your water bottles because they're much cuter and they're much cheaper y'all i'm obsessed with this freaking water bottle it's 26 ounces and it cost me 12 dollars and it matches my book bag like and it's pink so shout out to her for putting me on because i was gonna go to target to get my water bottle or i was just gonna order one on amazon to be honest i always gotta have my water stay hydrated and something i like to do is add lemon into my water if y'all watch my uh weekly workouts video then you know that especially for the people who be like oh water don't have no taste and be saying that's their excuse why they don't drink it girl add some lemon add some lemon to your water change it um i have some eggs boiling right now that's gonna be my breakfast six boiled eggs that's 30 gram no i'm boiling five eggs that's 25 grams of protein period and say good morning fatty But she's so cute, I can't help it. It is, it's 8.44. I don't have class at 12. I'm up super freaking early. I probably didn't even have to get up this early, but it's cool. I really don't mind. Um, And this is something like, I don't know if y'all are going to find this funny, but okay, so y'all see my alarm? Okay, y'all see it? I'm going to try to zoom in. It literally says, hold on, can it focus? Get up. And when my alarm started going off at 8.30, y'all know that Meek Mill meme that's been going around? Get up! Get up! My alarm started going off and the, the word get up was in big letters and I just automatically read it in the meme. Like the way the meme goes, get up! I don't know if you're gonna find that funny. It was funny to me though. The scent I'm wearing today is Aquatic Vanilla. You guys can click the link down below in my description box to get some money off your Dossier perfumes. Okay, Dossier perfumes sells affordable luxury perfumes for the low. So make sure you guys head over to Dossier.com and use my code down below in my description to get some money off your perfumes. Girl, I get so many freaking compliments every time I wear Dossier. This scent right here smells like a rich vanilla and I love it so much. I get so many compliments when I wear this perfume. I get so many compliments when I wear any of my Dossier perfumes. This is Floral Marshmallow. This one smells like Fruity Pebbles and Vanilla. It smells so freaking good. Um, I have another one which is Fruity Almond which is also another one of my favorites. If you want to smell like money and get a whole bunch of compliments y'all, literally head to Dossier.com. Like even girls, guys, especially the guys, the guys are always complimenting how well that I smell. So don't say i didn't tell you don't say i didn't try to put you on i got a code down below make sure i click the link i've been wearing dossier perfume for literally over like two three years and i can say it's some of the best perfume i've ever had if you like to smell like luxury if you don't want to buy expensive name brand perfumes make sure you guys head to dossier.com because you can smell like luxury for an affordable price this is my breakfast literally some boiled eggs i don't eat the yellow part i leave some of the yellow part just so i can get the benefits of it like there's barely any yellow part 
And I just raw dog them just like that. And that's why I'm so fucking strong. You wanna get your weight up? Eat some eggs. No salt, no pepper. Nathaniel. Straight egg. I know somebody's gonna find this disturbing. I just know it. That's how real it is. The time is currently 10.18 and your girl is dressed for school. This is what I'm wearing. The sun has come out, so I'm wearing a vest, my scrubs, pink New Balances. Um, I have a black sweater under. And yeah, it's the sun is the sun is coming out, y'all. It's gonna be nice today. I spoke too soon. Um, because I didn't even check the weather and I'm talking about it looks like it's not gonna be nice today. It's gonna go up to like 68 degrees today. You act the mad funny and I don't like that. But yeah, I'm about to put my camera in my bag. I'm about to be on my way to school. It's like 10 20 right now. Um heading there like a little early. Because my class is online and I'm just going to pick like somewhere in the building to do my class. Which is probably going to be like the lunchroom or something. So, you know, read a book, chill until class is ready. Class is until 12. So, and I just don't feel like being in the house. I'm dressed because so I'm ready to go. Count my shit. Just a step in out, I feel like I'm that nigga shit. I drop 30 on this room, we ain't gonna sleep for shit. If I catch you knocking off, then it's gonna be some shit. Well, you can do what you wanna live how you wanna spin what you wanna be who you wanna be we all stun up to la di a e you can do what you wanna live how you wanna spin what you wanna be who you wanna be we all stun up to la di a e i got out the shower probably <laughs> A good 20 minutes ago it's currently 8 13 p.m i got out of class early today and then i headed to the gym um took a shower um, my mom is making dinner and i just finished meditating and i definitely definitely needed it because my mind was just like thinking about all the stuff that i need to do so i did a meditation to like ease my mind um after i left the gym i went to walgreens and i got a five subject college rule notebook because i only have one notebook for my classes like and i'd be writing all my notes in there and the class i had today we just learned about pole sites and pulse the pulse sites locations and then we went around the class and we were taking each other's pulses and stuff like that and then we had to fill out like a chart of like the beats per minute that we got so that's what we did today in class and then when we finished taking each other's pulses our teacher let us go early so i got out of school like two or like yeah i got out of school like two something when i'm really supposed to get out at four so that was real nice of my teacher um i also bought some glasses some reading glasses so i can like see things better in class i'm not gonna try them on for y'all right now I'll, I'll let y'all see those later and yeah for the rest of the night i'm gonna eat and after i eat i'm gonna study and that's really about it for today y'all tomorrow's thursday i have the same schedule as tomorrow i have a class from 12 to 1 well tomorrow i have to go into school extra early because i got scheduled for a 10 a.m orientation for our ipad because like i told you my school gives out an ipad that's literally like where you see your syllabus all your classes the quizzes and i do have a quiz coming up on friday which is due on sunday and it's gonna be on the ipad so i definitely have to get my ipad tomorrow so the orientation is scheduled for 10 a.m they sent me a text so i have to wake up early like i mean i already be getting up early but i gotta be at the school before 10 o'clock so because tomorrow i have a class at 12 so i'll be at the school from 10 to 4. i actually do like learning like i feel really productive like i told you i like to feel productive so i feel like i'm actually on like for the first time in my life i really feel like i'm on track with like life and it feels so freaking good to have stuff going on for yourself i'm not gonna lie if y'all feel lost and you don't know what to do with your life please get in school because that was me like i was feeling so lost and feel like i didn't know my purpose 
in life or just feel like I didn't know what I was doing in my life and going to school definitely flipped the script for me like I feel so freaking good there's not a day well as of yet I hope it, I hope it never gets like this but there's not a day where I've been like damn I don't want to go to class like damn I don't want to go to school like I actually look forward to it I'll check back in with you guys just in a little bit but I just finished meditating and it really did help I've been doing that more often because like we just be going through the whole day and stuff like that without sitting down and actually taking time to pay attention to what your thoughts are you know what you're thinking in your mind or to even just take a deep breath so i've been trying to include meditation in my day-to-day -day practice more just so i'm not like too overstimulated because i get overstimulated okay like if too much is going on i literally be feeling like oh, what the fuck like i want to scream so to stop myself from being so overstimulated or when i do feel overstimulated I just meditate and breathe. Okay, okay. There's some cucumbers, fettuccine noodles with ground turkey and Alfredo and tomato sauce mixed together with some Parmesan cheese and some mozzarella cheese. Y'all, this shit must. I'm gonna study for the class that I have tomorrow, but also review the stuff that we went over today in I don't know what this class is really called, but today the class I had we went over pulse sites and pulse sites locations So I learned temporal apical Radical or is it radical? I know okay, so I'm gonna list the ones that I can remember so there's temporal radical apical ulnar Papateal, posterior tibula, dorealis pedis, uh, brachial, which is the pulse site that's right here at the bend of the elbow. Um, there's two more. There's two more. Um, femoral, that's your groin, your pulse site where your groin is. And there's one more. Hold on, what's this one? I listed nine, there's 10. Okay, oh, the neck. Okay, so it's radical, temporal, carotid, apical, brachial, ulnar, femoral, popliteal, posterior tibula, dorealis pedis. So the one I was missing was the car cardioid. And my professor, he said to remember it like cardi cartioid, like karate chop, like, feel me? He said to remember it like that. I always forget that one because I have the notes here on my Google Docs and I'm going to put it in my notebook. I feel like when you write things out, it's much more easier to remember by like writing stuff out. The class that I have tomorrow is a little bit more on the difficult side for me personally. Maybe because I got thrown in there like a little late, so like I'm fake behind, but it's a lot of big freaking words to remember. That's That's what I know. So I'm just going to do it to the best of my ability. Um, so I'm going to go ahead and read over some stuff. And yeah, that's really going to be about it for my night. I will see you cuties tomorrow morning because there's nothing going on for the rest of the day. But me studying. So I will catch you cuties tomorrow morning because I have iPad orientation. So your girl has to get up extra early today or tomorrow so i'll catch you cuties tomorrow hey y'all good morning it's currently 7 12 a.m your girl woke up at 6 a.m today i just finished getting ready for school i have my ipad orientation today which is at 10 a.m so i have to be by the school by like nine something so i'm gonna leave my house at like 7 40 ish eight o'clock i'm about to eat some breakfast and boil eggs i didn't show my morning routine because i don't want this video to get too repetitive but today i have two classes um i'll get out of school about 4 p.m and then i'll be heading to the gym tomorrow is friday so i have <laughs> excuse me tomorrow is friday so i have classes online and let me see what the weather is gonna be like because <sighs> Through this whole video, I've been wanting to go and just sit in nature and freaking relax. Friday's gonna be 58 degrees, it's gonna be sunny, so I might take the opportunity that day since I'm technically like off. Well, I'm not off, but I have a class online, which is from 9 a.m. to 
9 a.m. to 12 p.m. and I'll be taking that class in my house. So after that class, most likely, hopefully God's will, I can go sit in some nature. Isn't there like a saying where like, oh, when you make plans, God laughs? Because honestly, like we can plan as much as we want to, but at the end of the day, sometimes life just happens. So, and there's just been like, I just haven't had the chance to go sit in nature basically and it's getting hot outside and I want to be doing that more often to be honest but I'm about to eat my breakfast after I eat my breakfast I am going to head out the door and go to my iPad orientation I really don't know how much I'm going to be vlogging today in school I feel like I'm not going to vlog that much to be honest <laughs> and then yesterday I had like the worst well, it happens sometimes, but I had the worst freaking, I had the worst gym session, like, it was not hitting. I think because I was doing too many legs, as y'all saw, I did not hit anything else throughout this video but legs. That's my fault. Um, I, I should have been focusing, focusing on the other areas of my body, but I think I overdid it with the legs. Um, not that my legs, my legs don't hurt or anything like that, but I think my body was just super freaking fatigued since like I deadlifted on Tuesday, then hit legs after I finished, I finished deadlifting, and then that Monday I trained legs super hard. Like Monday and Tuesday I trained legs super hard back to back, and then I tried to train legs yesterday, and that workout did not feel good, like, at all. Waist of a cute gym fit. Hey guys, it's currently 8.45. I'm here at like the general admissions office because um, before I go get my iPad at 10 a.m., I'm gonna f finish filling out my FAFSA, which I have to do that because I already completed some of it, but I haven't finished all of it. But no outfit of the day. All right, so I'm gonna update y'all throughout the day. If you made it this far, you made it to the end of the video. Thank you guys so much for watching. It feels so good to be back on YouTube. I hope you guys really did enjoy this vlog. If you guys want to watch the rest of like the weekly vlog, because today is Saturday, I am vlogging today, tomorrow, and the rest of the week. If you guys want to watch that, stay tuned for next week's weekly vlog. Give me a big thumbs up, okay? Comment down below. What do y'all want to see from me, okay? Let me know down below in the comments. Subscribe if you are new here. Turn on your bell notification so you're notified every single time your girl double C is back on the scene and that's all period okay i enjoyed filming this weekly vlog so much like y'all if y'all want a life update from me ask me questions let me know and i'm really excited to bring you guys along on this new chapter in my life and y'all can get to know the new chanel because i'm always changing so <laughs> i hope you guys enjoyed this video follow me on instagram tiktok all my other social medias to keep up with me when i'm not on youtube and i will see you cuties in my next video bye